Hey guys, Ohio Wolverine here. Um, I was recently contacted by a representative of a company um, that makes a lot of products pretty, out of China. And you've probably all seen these products. You can get them on Amazon. And uh, he asked if I would be uh, interested in doing some reviews and testing out some of their uh, products and equipment. And uh, I told him, yeah, go ahead. Uh, send it out to me. Let's see what you got. And the first thing he sent me was from, now, let me see if I get this name right, X, um, Ages, X Ages, uh, did you see there, X A Ages, okay, uh, M-Lock Compatible Adjustable Bipod. This is kind of a neat little product, um, it's kind of weird, let's take a look at it and you'll see not just a bipod but it's two and they attach to your M-lock rail and go on either side of your uh, fore end there so let's take a look what else we got and it comes with some uh, allen wrenches looks like three different sizes here so if I can get these open get those out and let's see this in. There's one. And there's the other side. So, well, there's no typical sides or anything, so it doesn't need to be left or right or anything. They're both identical, as you can tell. Okay, very lightweight. I think they say it, they weigh like 10.3 ounces. Um, 5.7 inch to 8 inch um, extended. So, pretty nifty there. Now, it does not have a spring in it, so it's not spring loaded, but it's you don't even have to push this down. All you gotta do is pull, and it is adjustable. So, there's different, there's five different levels that you can adjust it to. And then there's a button here. You push that button, and as you can see, this pops up, unlocks it from the different. There's five different settings that you can set that way. So it's a uh, precision uh, precision machine, lightweight aircraft grade aluminum, um, anodized matte black finish. Um, now these are actual plastic, not real rubber, not real rubbery, it's just a, like a kind of a hard plastic. So, and there's of course the M-Lock, it says it takes up two slots. So, and it seemed uh, pretty sturdy, I don't know. It's, that's just the noise from that. but. Does make a little bit of noise. Um, well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Under the magic of editing, I want to stop the video for a second, and I'll be back because I don't want to violate any community standards and you know be accused of showing somebody how to modify a scary black rifle or anything. So I'll be back in just a jiffy. Okay. And uh, through the magic of editing, once again, we're back. And installation was about just a little over a minute at the most, probably. Didn't take long at all. And that's what we're looking at once they're installed. So. Doesn't add much weight. Doesn't seem like very much different in the you know, I shoulder it. Um, yeah, let's just see here. Just push in this button here, move it down, put it in the position you want it. Let's see, there's that straight down. And uh, like I said, they're not spring loaded, so we just grab them. There you go. X Aegis M Lock compatible bipod um 
pretty sturdy. Like I said, those little feet, they're not rubber, they're plastic, so they do slip a little bit on the wood here, uh, on the mat. Pretty sturdy on the mat. A little bit of weight on it. Not a whole lot of give. So, um, yeah, kind of a neat product. Um, don't have to say that I, I do like it. Um, one thing I did notice that I do like um, is a lot of times on these ARs and stuff, um, if you go with one of the Harris bipods that you have to put to your Picatinny rail down here or whatever, um, a lot of times you got to put the sling on that little ring that comes with the Harris bipod. I'm not a big fan of that. So original sling can go in the original spot on this. And this is an m &P 15 Sport, so it's not anything outrageous or extravagant or anything so yeah I like it um, what I'll do is I will leave a link if I can in the description if you want if you're interested in ordering these uh, from Amazon through the uh, X Aegis company and uh, also I wanted to talk about uh, some of our rights and Second Amendments. I uh, recently became partners with the Gun Owners of America, and uh, I will include that link down below. And you can click on that link and take you right to a to a page to sign up, and join today, or um, renew a membership if you already have one. Um, I do you believe it's a discount, 25% discount? I think a normal rate is. Twenty dollars to join. If you take this link, you can join for fifteen for a year of membership. So, great organization. Uh, the only organization that's no no compromise on our rights. So, but thanks for watching, everybody. Once again, X Aegis M Lock compatible bipod. Um, check it out. Um, you might like it. Thanks for watching.